Dr. Apoki, one of the finest social activists in Nigeria, said this about Tinibu. Tinibu is the pepper soup we all cooked. We will drink of it. Would you agree with him? <laughs> Viewers and subscribers, you're welcome back. This is still BVI Channel 1, where we tell you undiluted truth. Dr. Apoki, a philanthropist, a farmer, and a public speaker, one of the finest social activists in Nigeria, said this about Tinibu. I am Dr. Charles Apoki. I want to ask a question. Nigerians, how market now? During the elections, I did a video. Why hate the Igbos in their own country? And hell was let loose. A lot of people attacked me. Now, Peter Obi was an option. But others decided to choose otherwise. I have a neighbor near me here. When I told him, who would you vote for? He said, how will I vote for an Igbo man when my brother is contesting? Ironically, his wife is an Igbo woman. Recently, I saw him. He was looking tattered. I asked him, how market now? There's a problem in this country the poor that you want to fight for, they are the ones who hate you and, and fight you. They suffer from what is called Stockholm Syndrome, where they fall in love with those who kidnap them and rape them. Andrew Cuomo, the governor of New York, rightly said during COVID, say when things go bad, the poor pay the highest price. But the problem I have with Nigeria the poor don't know how to make the right choices. The poor are the enemies of their own progress. I want to ask a simple question. Those thugs that were throwing away ballot boxes, that were carrying ballot boxes to run in Lagos, how market now? How transport fare? How cement price? How price of food? When I don't be hungry, eh? And I don't they get small sense. I want to ask another set of people, those of you in the north, who said that instead of an Igbo man to rule, you are ready to go to war. Those are your leaders who made such stupid statements. Where are they? They have left you. Some of them have traveled overseas. And you are here, burning Nigerian flag. You are just wasting your energy. You are protesting. You are wasting your energy. Tinibu is going to be president for eight years. Eight years, and there's nothing you can do about it. Tinibu is the pepper soup we all cooked. We will drink of it. Wonderful. Would you agree with him? To me, to a large extent, I will. Because he is addressing ethnic bigots. To either get sense now or never. Because come 2027 will be another election where ethnic bigotry will still play a key role. Tinibu is actually the pepper soup. Every one of us prepared, and we are eating the pepper soup. Why will he say everyone? Some will disagree with him, say, not Nigerians did not vote for him. All Nigerians did not vote for him. But Nigerians actually generally condoned him. Condoned the madness condone that charade of an election because if all nigerians came out in mass all those who did not vote uh, uh, for tinibu who we know majority of nigerians never voted for tinibu if they had stood their ground and said no to that election rigging and charade of a judgment by the supreme court of injustice we have in this country to be honest with you we will not be where we are and that is where i agree with him the point is that Nigerians did not vote for him. That is quite correct. But literally, if you are considering it in that manner, uh -huh, you could be right to say, yes, we didn't vote for Tinibu. Nigerians never voted for Tinibu from the east, west, north, and south. I keep saying it. He never got up to 1.5 million votes totally in that election. 
or every other thing was padded by INEC. Afterwards, they told us to go to court. Afterwards, they gave their Bella Blue judgment. And Nigerians kept quiet. But it is fine, though. It is fine that it's happening this way. Because they will target on either the evils, P2B, or the obedience. That they want to destabilize Nigeria. It is good that it is happening this way. That we have tested it. And they pepper the heart. Maybe 2027, Nigerians will get sense. If your mumu never do, perhaps what you are going through today, we reset your mumu factory fitted medulla oblongata. Let me keep it at that. What is your take on it? Do you think that actually Tinubu is the pepper soup Nigerians cooked? <laughs> this one got me. Share it on the comment section. You can always follow him, Dr. Apoki, a wonderful man. Bye-bye for now. <laughs>